Hi guys, this is Krista of Pinay's Kitchen and today I'm going to show you how to make a quick Spam Musubi. So you slice your Spam like this. I use this particular Spam because I'm Filipino. I love this Spam with Tocino seasoning. Um, this way, you don't have to season it anymore with soy sauce, sugar. It's already sweet enough and it has that um, saltiness enough. So you don't have to season it with anything. Try this. It's really good. Oh, and by the way, do not throw away the Spam can because you're going to use that later to um, shape your musubi. And then of course, I'm going to make an omelette. Just a simple omelette. I don't want to season this with anything. This is my version, guys. So you can use you can use any seasoning for your version as well. I cook my eggs in butter because butter makes everything good. Okay, change my mind. I'll season it with salt. Just salt, just a little bit. <laughs> I flip mine like I feel like it's perfectly flipped so <laughs> but it has a little brown all right now we're gonna cook the spam I'm just gonna leave the whatever oils left from the egg earlier because the spam itself already have like oil in it so I'm just gonna render that and let that cook in its own fat just cook it until it you know it turns brown golden brown this is spam has um, has more sugar in it, so watch out because sugar actually burns faster. So just keep an eye on it, okay? See what I'm talking about? Now it's a little bit. So your heat must be medium low for these. See? You see that darker? That's the sugar, guys. Should be good. All right, I have a plate lined with paper towel here, so it soaks up the fat. Leave everything there. All right, now we're gonna form our egg. So just take the, um, you know, the 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 middle part of the spam, and just like, you know, just. Put it there and then you're gonna have to uh, use a knife to form your egg so see what i'm doing so just put it there if there's extra that's fine you can just like put it too so it's fine do not worry about it what I mean you got that perfect perfect egg shape <laughs> perfect spam shape so now I have the rice here the cooked rice here so we're gonna add some rice vinegar just, just a quick splash you know some people use sugar I think that's the traditional way you put sugar but I don't want to put sugar anymore because my spam is sweet already and you can put seasoning here as well um, they have a uh, in, in Asian stores you can see like rice seasoning I don't have rice seasoning but for me the sugar the rice vinegar is enough I just want it simple y'all spam your plastic wrap or a cling wrap rice Make sure to push the rice with the back of the spoon to make it even in the bottom. Sesame seed, roasted crushed sesame seed. You can add your rice seasoning if you have one. Your egg, egg first, and then the spam. Make sure to press your spam down to make it tight. Take it off. You can like roll it like that. 
It should be tight enough once you take it off the plastic. And then it will be ready to wrap it with the nori sheets. So you have your nori sheets here. What you're gonna do is you're gonna wanna cut it like as big as this spam. So what I'm gonna do is I wanna cut it actually like this. Shiny side out, okay? Now you can... Water can help, by the way, guys. So if you can just like add a little bit of water there, it will help. There you go. That's our musubi. Another one. Mm. And here we go. Here's our spam and egg musubi. Mm. Looks good. Let me try. Mmm. Mmm. It was a good idea that I didn't add sugar on my rice because the spam itself is already sweet. And you can actually dip this in Japanese mayo if you have one. And if you have like a teriyaki glaze, you can glaze them, you know, just to add some flavor. But me, this is perfect. Thank you again, guys, for watching. If you like this video, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please click that subscribe button below with the bell button for notifications on my new videos and live streaming. Don't forget to comment and share this video as well. Until then, I love you guys. Take care and I'll see you again soon. Again, this is Krista of Pinay's Kitchen bringing flavors of the Pacific to your table. Thank you guys. Bye!